So we are having a good progress with the drywall finishing. The beads are looking uh, great and we have the last coat on things. So our doorways look really nice. And we are just about to put our Schluter Dietra membrane down and uh, start tiling. So what we've done, we are trying to find the highest point on the floor and unfortunately we found it and we found it way higher than the rest so we put a laser around and now these numbers you see this is how much lower the subfloor is in this spot compared to the corner which is the highest point like that level is level and I can just get my hand right under the level because I'm 5 8 lower than that corner that's really high so we have some decisions to be made. Like you see, I'm five eighths lower here, five eighths lower here, three quarters lower here. Plus we have a transition to the finished hardwood in the adjacent rooms. So we have a problem. And you may think, well, not a big deal. Just follow the subfloor, just go crooked with the tile. And uh, then you wouldn't have that problem. That is an opinion, but I'm sorry to say the wrong guy was hired for this because my floors are level. So this one will be level as well when we are done with that. So stay tuned for more news. So our uncoupling detra membrane is down and we are just rolling it for a full coverage and nice bond to the subfloor. We are not using thin set, we are using Ardex AF207 which is much nicer glue specially designed for getting the DITRA membrane on the subfloor. So this is our progress here and we'll deal with the unlevel subfloor tomorrow.